I don't think the door cares. I'll destroy you! You and your... My trademark Spankomatic 1000. Maybe this will create a lot of noise, make it come in here or something, but wait. If I create a racket and use the... The sardines stay in the tin. The oil will ensure the floor has the right sort of adhesion. This will make him make a lot of noise because he'll come running in and slap into the spangle magic. Now that I gotta throw the pebbles at him. So that's a classic. Mm. You know, if nothing else, then I can maybe use it as a projectile against him. I'll destroy you! You and your whole family! What the? Casual. Destroy you! You and your whole family! It's a door! What the? Destroy you! You and your whole family! What the? You know, it's fortunately that um, this guy has an IQ as low as his tube size. Otherwise, this might actually not work. Ah. Mm. Yeah. yeah, that sounds like somebody who's falling. Mm. I've blocked the door. That should hold Monkus up until we and the artifact are out of here. What did Monkus leave just now? A mirror. I'll take that. I bet the treasure chamber with the artifact. Right. Already looked at that, so moving on. Mm. 
that's my homemade fishing rod. It mainly consists of a stick and an unbreakable line that's several meters long. I come in handy. I don't think that the rings will help me again, at least not without a new series of symbols. That's what I was afraid of. There's no kidding around with trolls. Ivo! made him mad. Not entirely sure if that's a good thing. Didn't intend to skip dialogue, but sometimes I don't know if I have to for these items. In a cutscene or not. There's a steep drop down there, and even I had problems climbing back up the cliffs. He's a real problem. Trolls are almost invulnerable and incredibly tough. One can only eliminate something like that by using one's wits. They both look unharmed, for now. Once Munkus has got what he wants, it'll be curtains for them. I can't move from here. They both look unharmed. What is this? Is this just a symbol just floating without it? Let's roll this again. Better not. Last time his laziness triumphed over his anger, but it could get a bit uncomfortable for me next time. I should really try and ensure that a third attempt is not required. Do you want from it then? The base of a column. I can't get to it as long as a troll's standing there, and just waiting for him to accidentally stumble on it isn't an option. Then clearly we must be lacking something. Limited nope, I'm staying up here. I need the crystals to open the other door over there, but one of the boys is going to have to help me with this. Maybe we can use the crystals and the fishing rod together to sort of learn the troll around. No. I don't think I'm missing anything in here. No. These are required. These are the required necessities. Let's try to use them for something. If I leave cover, then the Thank you. 
tripping these? Do one for me. Better not. I should read. I can't move from here. If I leave cover, they both... What do you want from me? Uh, I'll go back into the temple and check, maybe I missed something. Be right back. This is apparently a thing I can attack with. His claw, which at first... <sighs> so this might be what this over here is referring to, the upgrade that's here. Well, that wasn't the troll would see me. Oh, now I can talk to them! Oi, troll! You're stupid as a... well, a troll! What are you doing? You're even stupid for a troll! You shouldn't. If your club had woodworm, it'd be smarter than you. He doesn't mean it really, Wilbur. How does that even work? Like, how did you... Whatever, I don't want to... Hey, question. look over here. <laughs> that was awesome. That made absolutely Quick, no Prius, sense. And then we're out of here. <laughs> we can't believe it. Even a splash sound effect? Come on! Pressure. No treasure is worth that. Don't you know who that fat little guy is? And who his mother is? I know! I've eliminated him! You've done what? Get the ship ready for departure. Wilbur and I'll get the treasure and we'll be back in a second. I will get the ship ready, and as soon as it's ready I will depart, with or without you two. But... but Captain Nate! You know as well as I do that you can't simply run away and hide. I've trapped Mortroga's son and you were there. I'm done for. Only the Archmage can protect you, and he wants the treasure, so wait here. <clears throat> Let's go. So that was, um... Wow! Annoying. Almost a little eerie. Let's do it. Let's carry on and get us some treasure. What kind of monster do you think the statue represents? I hardly think that's relevant. Well, now that you said it, it is. Maybe so. Oh! Ah! Ivo? Hmm? It's dark. I'm not really good with the dark. Then you should sort out some light. I can't help at the moment. Hmm. Okay. So maybe it wasn't just a door. Examine the nothingness. Wah! Ah, a dried up corpse. Its skin is like paper and it it's a box. Got it! Try your luck here. Ah, something hard, wooden, bones maybe? Living skeletons that Perhaps it's just simply wood. Hmm, or, or or that. Something cold, made of metal, I think. Like a sphere with round protrusions. Some part of this thing are made of glass, it seems. It's quite heavy, but it's hollow. There's an opening on one side, so it's a kind of container. That was a diving hill. Whoa! G ghosts or, or 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 something like that. Hmm. Or some kind of cloth, a cape maybe. No help to me anyway. Whoa! Warm and soft, like a bag of warm fat. That's me. 
Why are you so soft? You're anything but fat. Those are not my ribs. Oh. Would you kindly get your hands off me now? Sorry. That's Ivo. And there's absolutely no reason for groping her again. I just want to know those additional problems. Oh, that's a, a thing. Something metallic. Here's some kind of thick, rough cloth and rubber. No idea what it is. This thing's too big and heavy to move, and it doesn't look like there are any loose parts. Hmm, something liquid, yeah? I'd love to be able to say it's water, but it stinks horribly. A stinky liquid of some sort smells tangy and caustic. That's because you've been eight. A stinky Glowing lights, but they're really far off, and I have no idea what's between here and there. It could be an abyss, or a maze. The thing's only a few metres away. Maybe it's a teeny tiny maze. Just sort out some light. Hmm, the box is full of little packages. And the packages are full of dried square things. Feels like cubes of dried grass. It smells a bit like it did in sea stone, like sea ocean. It's so familiar. Mm. I know what they are. Dried jelly glowfish. Jelly glowfish are always shipped dried in small boxes. Did you just lick the jelly glowfish? Uh. No. Then how do you know what jelly glowfish taste like? Well, that's my business. Right. Would you pour it in? I the should thing? put some liquid in the container first. Oh, well, oh, amazing. I filled the container with that stinky liquid. Good. Now pour the jelly in, so we can actually see what the heck we're doing. I'll put the container down here and put a jelly glowfish in it. Uh, Ivo? Yeah? I don't think that was a passage. You don't say. <laughs> Good work. Uh, I think we should get out of here. Fast. Not without us getting what we came for. I also don't think I didn't notice but that thing had been lying there the entire time. That he didn't actually pick it up. I you noticed. Mean... Absolutely. The artifact of divine fate. It isn't just being guarded by the monster. It's in the monster. Let's get it. Hmm. A jelly glowfish looks anything but happy. No wonder. Stomach acid is not the preferred habitat for jelly glowfish. Hmm. Maybe I could use the barrel as a boat, but I'd still need a paddle. I can hardly row with my hands. I know what these are. They let you breathe underwater. Grandad used to use these while fastening bombs to the bottom of orc ships. Unfortunately, the fuses kept going out. A lovely suitcase filled with all sorts of expensive clothes. Lace, silk, long johns, only the best. These clothes don't fit me. Too bad, really, because sometimes it gets a touch breezy under my mage robes. 